am gândit foarte mult la asta, n-am venit cu nicio idee, n-am fost de acord cu celelalte idei, mă depășește ideea și atunci am zis, bă, n-are rost, trebuie să-mi scot din cap treaba asta. Și ce dacă nu suntem singuri în univers? Și ce dacă suntem singuri? Și ce contează când a început? Trăim pe perioadă scurtă. Sunt uh, necredincios ortodox, ca să zic așa. Așa că nu pot să zic că l-a făcut Dumnezeu. Nu... Bă, e o întrebare mult prea mare pentru mine. Păi dacă nu știm unde se termină și unde începe, cum putem să știm unde a început Universul? Când a început? E doar o presupunere. În general, eu zic că e o presupunere prea mare pentru umanitate în prezent. Sau dacă e prea mare pentru mine, mă mulțumesc cu condiția. Cum se numește? Cum e cuvântul ăla? Îmi scap acum. Nu știu. Sunt ignorant la capitolul ăsta. What is the single most significant physical evidence that a creator God has created our universe? I think that the most important physical evidence for the existence of a creator of the universe is the remarkable discovery that the universe is not eternal in the past but began to exist. Up until the 20th century, the prevailing viewpoint among both philosophers and scientists was that the universe is eternal, that matter and energy have always existed, that the universe never began to exist, and therefore it seemed there was no need for a creator of the universe. That world view crumbled under the impact of Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity and its application in 1917 to the questions of cosmology. What Einstein's theory predicted was that the universe uh, cannot be a static, eternal, in effect timeless entity. Rather, the universe is either going to be in a state of a cosmic expansion or collapse. And in either case, this cannot be extrapolated to past infinity. It predicted that the universe, indeed time and space themselves, must have had a beginning at some point in the finite past. During the 1920s, observational astronomy began to uncover evidence for these purely theoretical predictions that Albert Einstein's theory had made. So that today the prevailing view among contemporary cosmologists and astrophysicists is that the universe is not in fact infinite in the past, but that time and space, matter and energy are finite and came into being at some point a finite time ago. And I think this is the most powerful evidence ever to come out of science for the existence of a transcendent cause of the universe which brought the universe into being.